Her story for a while now and will continue to do that. Of course, we were talking earlier about something. I don't know if, if everybody knows about you have certain pins that you wear <laughs> on certain days. What, what is this one? This this is is this your favorite one? This it's the birdie pin. The birdie pin well, and it's it, birdie club. Birdie club. Okay, yeah. and it means that you were successful, I guess, today. Yeah, I, I had at golf. least one birdie. Yeah. All right. Nice. But, so um, there's the I visual cue. I appreciate you bringing it up. Yes, yeah, yeah. I get to brag a little bit. But um, beautiful weather outside. If you've gotten to enjoy it the last couple of days, it's been a treat. I'm relishing in it because I know what's lurking. You know, just a couple of months away, the stagnant heat that doesn't really change on a day to day basis. I love the variability looking ahead to Easter Sunday. It's going to be a lot warmer than it was today. Plenty of humidity and breezy. Those winds will be up over 20 miles per hour at times on Easter Sunday, partly to mostly cloudy skies. Uh, does not look like any rain at this point right now. It's beautiful outside. We do have an easterly breeze get it mm -hmm. yeah we can do it this week because it's easter sunday 76 out right now dew point at 48 comfortable feeling we were talking about the rain possible here yesterday for earlier today you can see some of those showers that were mainly west and north of corpus christi a few more showers and thunderstorms rolling through the hill country and central texas that's thanks to this upper level energy that will move through the state uh, tonight and tomorrow high pressure takes over going to be beautiful feeling weather tomorrow 80 degrees a little bit of a breeze coming in from the southeast starting tomorrow but it really ramps up on Friday high pressure to our east and then a little low pressure system at the surface will develop that combo is going to elevate the winds and on Friday I think we're going to have some gusts approaching 40 miles per hour. It stays breezy, warm and humid with more clouds into the weekend. So Easter Sunday highs will be in the middle to lower 80s under partly to mostly cloudy skies. It'll be stickier feeling outside and then our cold front. The next one to come through here looks like it comes in dry next Tuesday and it does bring back some comfortable weather. So Another cool morning for us tomorrow, then a high of 80. Note the overnight lows as that humidity starts to build in. It's not going to be as cool. 70 for a low Monday with a high of 90. There's the cold front, which brings back the mid 50s at night, mid 70s in the daytime behind it. We'll see the humidity also rise into the weekend. Muggy on the muggy meter. It'll be quite humid, then a drop in humidity behind the front coming in on Tuesday. Tonight, the three C's clear, calm and cool. 53 are overnight low tomorrow. A sunny delight, cool morning, a little breezy in the afternoon. Winds up to around 20 miles per hour with a high of 80 degrees. We'll still have some minor coastal flooding on area beaches. Elevated rip current risk with the longer period swells. Seven seconds on the waves coming into the near shore Gulf waters. Friday again, very windy winds gusting up to around 40 miles per hour. Easter weekend looks like a partly to mostly cloudy weekend. 80s for highs and then our front comes in next Tuesday offering us more delights. Ooh, we like and it. we'll take mm -hmm. them. Not Very out of the exciting. Forecast yet, so we'll take as many as we can get between now and you know June one. Oh, for <laughs> sure. Yeah. yeah, Alan. Thank you. Still to come here on three news.